Yeah. I'm going to guess a Captain Falcon Link and... Oh, pardon me. Captain Falcon Link and Jigglypuff. Oh, that's right. I forgot to play Jiggly in Smash 4, didn't he? I was going to throw out a random one and say Inkling because, you know, that seems to be the... Well, we're going to see... We're going to definitely see... Cat Falcon and Link. Link, I believe now, I'm so. expecting Pikachu as a third, but it could be something completely different. Um, you know what? I'm going to throw it out there. I'm going to. All right. If it's not Jigglypuff, I'm going to throw out my random third option. Uh, it's going to be Incineroar. You think so? Yeah, I'm going to say Incineroar. I can see it. I can see it. I think Incineroar is good in this game. People will think I'm funny for saying that. Okay. I think he's a very. He's very average. <laughs> he's good in doubles. I'll give him that. I haven't seen him in doubles today. It's stupid. Because you just hit him and then you do the 70% yeah, on them. Yeah, start of the match, teammate hits him, he gets revenge. Is, I don't think revenge is halved. I was going to say, depending on the move hit that's hitting in Cineroar, say if I do like a Thunder Jolt compared it's to a forward smash, it does. okay, it's the damage and it just doubles it. It's uh, I saw the algorithm. The da algorithm as far as, somebody's going to correct me, but from the best of my memory, it's point zero zero five. Ganondorf. I should have seen that coming. Yeah, I would have seen that. It's like point zero zero something. I want to say point zero zero like seven five or point zero zero five. Okay. Times one point five plus the damage done. Okay. Interesting. Okay, here we go. This is It's confusing. Basically all I know is he gets revenge, that dude's gonna start spamming Sandy. Squad strike, let's go. Squad strike. Ganon oh wait, it was oh Captain Falcon. Captain Falcon and versus DK, DK is the first one. This is gonna be disgusting. Alright, let's see how the man does it. Ooh, running some back and forth. Now this is a... Uh, everybody here who's watching this knows this. This man, Fatality, Captain Falcon. He's pretty Falcon. sick. We'll say that. Uh, I heard he's pretty good with Captain Falcon. Yeah. Now, is he the best? That's a sight to be seen. But uh, I, heard, I heard this guy's pretty good. I heard he's uh, placed really well in uh, some pretty pretty known tournaments. You yeah, know? I think I've seen some. Yeah. That uh, one Civil War tournament. You know? Oh, yes. I, still can, I, I personally... <laughs> oh. You, you hate to see that happen. You hate to see that happen. But why worry when you got the, the, next, the next best boy coming up, Link? Some people say he's the best Link. Besides, you know, it was a uh, young Link when the first when the game right, first yeah. came yeah, out. Yeah, let's cool down. Everybody lagless. putting Link in like top five. Can we cool down for a minute here? Uh, oh, this Link? No, no, just ink, Link in general. Like, oh, okay, normal yeah, Link. Yeah. Oh no. Maybe. Every, every, I'm seeing so many people being like, yo, normal Link is like top five. I'm saying he's like, okay, yo, dog, like Ink Link, Peach, Prom, Peach. I could totally Peach see top fifteen because totally like he is pretty sick. Okay, but top fifteen, yeah, not yeah, five. yeah, yeah, not like, top five. Absolutely not. Not five. But I'm not gonna say he's better than like. 64 characters. Oh no. Ooh. Oh, that oh, was. That was, <laughs> was very good. Right there. There. Holy cow. All right. Uh, DK's built. Oh. He just let it rip. <laughs> Dude. He is not scared to let this. it rip. I mean, the dude's at 190%. You have to go for the Back big throw. plays right yep. now. Oh, he went for it. Uh, does Link actually kill? kill through? Okay, yeah. Oh, yes, he does. There, there's our answer. Didn't think about that. Now, as for uh, Squat Strike typical, uh, it takes forever for the character to spawn in. Now we have Isabel. Now, would you consider it cheating to play the character and the Echo Fighter? I know Villager's <laughs> not an Echo Fighter, but would you consider it cheating to play like, oh, I play Peach. Let me play Peach and Daisy in Squad Strike. I would consider that cheating. I think so. Because that's yeah. like, come on. Bro. We, yeah, because Peach and Daisy physically have, what, no differences besides... Uh, no differences. This, uh, the animation. Yeah, 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 that's the word. Is Krom still considered good? I've never seen Krom. Krom is still considered a good character. It's just that people know how to play against He him. just has some iffy matchups that, you know, people yeah. can really give him off stage. There's a lot of characters that can just abuse the crap out of him. But for the most part, yeah, he's I he's easily. Like, I mean, people have him like top five. I, I don't think so. I think I think he's top fifteen because only because of his off stage ability to you know it's so hard for him to get back. But his on stage is you know it's. Oh. Okay, now back to the match. Uh, we just saw that this man just step on a puppy. You know that meme? Like, would you take a million dollars to step on a puppy? This dude is like, I will step I will on a puppy to win a set. Ten million dollars. That's what he said. All right, but uh, we got Villager, the little boy whose dog that was. Uh, was that, was that what was that one really sad movie about dogs where there was like a million of dogs and they're all like an animator or something like that like World of Dogs or something? Hotel of Dog Hotel? I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, it was some weird movie. I may just be imagining it. Was, I don't know. It is close. They are both one hit away from death. That is the fact here. You know, I thought you were <laughs> memeing for a second, but then I saw no, that. No, it's and I was like, yeah. oh, no, he's true. That's why I threw it. Uh, that. Ooh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, the, the axe with the Dude. axe. The shining. I man. did not. I was thinking forwarder. That works. All right. Game one all taken right. by. What is this? Uh, affinity. Affinity? It was affinity, 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 or infinity. Okay. Yo, we got a challenge. Finish the squad strike, dude. <laughs> we are on our way. We get some sweet, like a little smash money there. <laughs> we have a change of control. Oh, uh, he might have had it wrong controls the whole time. That or he's changing up for. Understandable. You always gotta uh, make sure yeah, something feels right. wrong. You gotta go and check. Yeah. 
No shame lot. in it. I don't blame you. I wonder if we're gonna have the same six characters. Probably. It was really close. He did uh, get. He did die really early. Yeah, like it was really close. I don't see why they would change. It was still really. Now this I always forget about this because you have to set your name. Oh I, yeah, first time I did it, I was playing with tap jump on. <laughs> All those the same characters. Yep. Now the question is, are we gonna see the same order? I bet we that's do. not the order. I bet we do. He's, cha we do. he's changing up the order on the right just to make it go in the same order. DK, Captain. I'm gonna say Falcon, Falcon last. Captain, Captain. I'm gonna DK. say Falcon last. I'm okay. gonna say Link. Ga I'm gonna say Ganon, Link, then Falcon. Captain, Captain, did, oh my! Look at it. I was exact. I was, I was a hundred percent wrong. I didn't get a single <laughs> you got one exactly right. Backwards. I got nothing right. Oh my! I got the first one right. That's well. dude. If I play against this guy, he's gonna read me at every turn. I'm gonna be like, he's gonna like jump down, and do a dare. He's gonna like jump down and Falcon punch. Him. All right, here we go. Last time we saw DK Captain Falcon. Now it is Villager Captain Falcon, which is a completely different. We didn't matchup. see this one, but uh, it looks up. Uh, almost stepped him on his tippy toes oh, there. Damn. All right, Villager showing that uh, when he's on that ledge. Uh, not the hardest thing to get in top. That villager nair, oh my god. Such a good out of shield option. Dude, if you have a good nair in this game, you're like top tier. I know. My boy Ridley. Uh, uh, yep. <laughs> my boy Ridley's top tier, guys. He's got a good nair. Easily. Oh, that was top gear. Top 40, easily. Yeah. Just approaching in front of him like that, that's really scary. I feel like it's just so hard to hit this character. Like, especially with Captain Falcon, something tells me it's just. See, it's just it's really hard to hit him, but at the same time, it's like. It's real. It's kind of hard for him to kill you if you like you don't run up at him. Yeah, because he, he doesn't really have anything. That, oh, yeah, but I see. I feel like kill confirms with Captain against. Now, uh, see, I don't know if that missed or if the villager used the eye because Falcon has iframes. If I'm correct, it has a cup. Uh, I, 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 I don't know what because it looked like he just went straight through him with that. Yeah. Oh, uh, I think I thought he ear dodged, but Ooh. oh my gosh, that axe. Axe? Okay. On okay. Point today. Oh, it is infinity. Okay, so it's it is. Right. Okay. Oh, yep. Up smash. That's all it took. Yep. <laughs> Not giving a man a second to think. Dan is just like, just all right, we're ending up. this. I've been hit by way too many of those in my life. Here we go. Dude, That's same. an easy 30%. All right, all right. we got the. Oh. All right, we got the uh, the big boys here going on, doing some fighting. Now these guys do a hell of a lot of damage. Heck yeah. They and they can kill, but what they can't do is recover. Did they they nerfed DK's recovery, right? I feel like they did. Honestly. I know the, the it, feel, it feels like worse. I but think that's the uh, what's it called? The I uh, no. I think it just goes short. Ooh, okay. All right, all right. Didn't get the proper punish. Is he gonna get? The, right, what's he gonna do? Oh, Ooh. he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, he's not. No, oh, he's not. Forgot. Now he's dead. Yeah. I forgot. D okay, yeah. DK can still come. From yeah. Out. It just looked too low. Oh, here we go. This seems like a fun matchup for Ganondorf. Right Dude, now. I have a ton of fun watching this. I just love get I just love that pellet sound. Oh, that was a good read. That was a good read. Yeah, when she plants that, just kick it. Don't you don't gotta respect it. Just kick that thing. All right, I got the guy. What's gonna be the uh, pressure? Oh. Gonna go fishing, and nothing hits. <laughs> nothing hits. Respect. Oh my God. Lord. Barely. The spacing was Dude. barely off right there. Oh. There it is. Yep. The boot, the man. Boot. Yeah. What's the shape of Italy? The boot. Oh. I wonder if he'll switch up characters. Because last time Falcon got gamped and he, it was still close. This one was a this two one was stock, a I believe. Because he had Link left. Yes. Yeah, he had Link left. He didn't I'm sure left. he's comfortable with this three, though. Let's see. I don't blame him if he sticks it out, though. Yeah, yeah, he did, he did get that first game. He sometimes still... it's good to stick out the character. Oh, 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 oh I thought I saw Cloud. <laughs> oh, he's no, thinking about it. He is thinking. He, he, he is putting some hardcore Ooh, thought into this. Do it. Do Snake. I appreciate I love anybody who plays Snake. Very. Why do I love all the characters that everybody hates? Oh yeah, Simon, uh, Snake, and I play Simon. I play Snake. Two, I play yeah. Dark Samus. You know, I'm sitting here it's like I'm a piece of shit. Oh, I think he's going with it. You know what? And villager. If I were in his position, ah, I may. Okay, okay. You know what? If I was in his position, I don't know how to play Wolf, but if I was in his position, I can respect that. Absolutely. Because he got three characters. You're not stuck to one. Switch things up. You know, spice it up. Right? He's the spice of life. All right, Wolf. Wolf first. Easily. Wolf Link. Oh, I was gonna say Captain Falcon, but. Uh, you know what? This is game. Yeah, I, I can see that happening. Three. This is game three. One, yep. one. Both of them. Winner of this continues on. Your mic's that fantastic. Sam. I was supposed to from like 20 minutes ago, but thank you. <laughs> approaching with that forwarder, I can approach. Okay. <laughs> this is beginning a little nutty, but I can appreciate it. All right. Pretty much even right now. You know, got a couple rate like stray hits here. Doing a smash force trap. What under. a good move that forward to the wolves. Wolf is. People don't think Wolf is good. I think he's. Oh, oh my. dude. Ooh. I thought he had it. That would have been, so, been so hard to time. That would have been so, like, neato. But it wasn't Steve O. And can't yep, punish that. Yep, cannot. Yep. That's. Ugh. 
That's crazy. They forgot to animate the ending frame of Wolf's Smash Attack. <laughs> they just, they so they were just like, you know what, just don't give him. Is that how it was in uh, Brawl? Because I know it was really I good. I have no I idea. This character, he, he, he like... His animations look different, except for like his specials. Okay, because I know apparently forward smash was a really Dude, good Dude, that caught him. That caught him. That drag. They hit him with the outer hit, and it sent him straight up yeah. above. Him. So that's good. The low hit box, and that is really good when it comes to dragging. All right, so this wolf proven to be a really strong pick. Only now he's got to deal with some Link and Ganon. Now we saw Ganon do a lot of work in the last game, and Jesus Christ, it almost so killed. Don't. That's it, so hard. To, that's so right, hard. You to get challenge. hit by that offstage, yeah. you're going straight down. Actually. Luckily, I don't have to go off stage because I'm a Belmont. I just throw fire. You just <laughs> and oh. ah, I'm surprised he didn't try to edge guard. It's a Ganondorf. You can just drop down there. Oh yeah. You know, no, I, well, I, that's I, what he wanted. Yeah. Yeah. I can see. You know, I can see what Leffen's complaining about. Nobody goes off stage for edge guarding. Oh yeah, I saw his video about that. He's actually right. I mean, Smash Four players just because it was not a very good option. Because it wasn't a good option at four. Because yeah. so many characters like I'm just gonna come back. It was so easy just to ledge trap, which you know. Cover oh, the all options. right. What's the read? Um. Oh. Ooh, doing it again? I like it. Oh, that was that was almost disgusting. That was almost disgusting. All right, someone's gonna die right here. I'm calling it. Okay, Ooh, okay. The I was wrong. Through the I was wrong. Challenge him. And when these two guys are on the screen, I'm really like. When any two heavies are on the screen, it's very fun to watch. Oh, he saw this jump. I didn't even realize that. Down two is going low. Up smash. Oh my. Cleave the monkey in two, that my move dude. Is good. Many stocks in this game. Oh, going fishing. Bass Pro Fisher ain't this game, my dude. It's Smash Bros. Straight oh, up. Okay, I didn't know that killed. I think we uh, Link should learn how to do that now. You know, the fishing minigames, just bring that fishing rod. Can <laughs> can't do it, anything about it. All right, I'm going to say, Isabel's kind of got a hold of like all of Link's stuff. He got the boomerang in the pocket. Well, not anymore, actually, though, also. Now, this I'm confused as to hell is how it's going to go. Because yeah. Isabel doesn't want to approach. She Link wants to force him to approach. But yeah. Link can just throw shit. Isabel can't, surprisingly. And he has way more range Ooh, oh, wow. than Isabel as well. This is very smart. Very it. smart. That, is that it? That is it, oh, my friend. Oh my gosh, wow. Link coming up tornado style saying, I win. I saw him do the same thing against a, a King K rule and also killed. It's very good kill. So Fatality won that 2 1. Really good. Match. Affinity was really pulling it through, you know. I it could have gone either way. And uh those are pretty uh pretty interesting fun characters to watch. Okay. Are we doing doubles on the stream now? I have no idea. No, they're saying we're doing doubles on that stream. Oh they're doing okay, all on that one. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay. Yeah. I'll listen up, yeah. I'm not. That's up to you, my dude. I'll try to listen, I can't really <laughs> hear too much. Someone will someone will get our attention. All right, now I don't know either of these two players, so I don't know who either are going to play. I'm going to take a really big shot in the dark. I'm, okay, I'm going to guess one oh. of th one of them's uh, one of them's DK or, or 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 Captain Falcon. I don't know. It's I remember he was a Falcon. He was a Falcon. I don't know which one he was. Okay, we know. I Can't assume that guy's a Charizard player. Something just tells me. I'm not sure what it is, but he's going to play Ridley. He's playing Ridley. <laughs> he's going to play the better Charizard. The good Zard. El Toro. I'm, a, I'm calling it. Ah, oh, close enough. El Tiger. <laughs> Someone's excited. All right. So I'm going to call one of them is going to play. So except for the obvious, I'm going to call out a strange character right here. Okay. One of them is going to play. Let's see. One of them is going to play Snake. Not strange, but, you know, it's it's, it's, it's a good blanket pick. Oh, we did play a snake earlier. I about to say I haven't seen many snakes here. Snake is a we very too. annoying character. Very obnoxious character. Uh, not as much in doubles because Not as much in doubles because, you yeah. know, the opponent, the uh, his teammate is like, okay, uh, don't blow me up. And he has to be way more careful with his C4 and his grenades, which is his, you know, that's how he wins. Yeah. But in singles, though, oh, my gosh. People say he's not a top. I heard someone someone told me the other day Lefton he's not he a top. Buff. Yeah, he is easily. I think he's I think he's easily top okay. six or seven. So if we're going to get into personal thoughts about this, I don't think Snake is top tier. I don't think he's high tier. I think he's Snake tier, which is right in between those two. Because the dude has, like, such a huge disadvantage, but he has such a good advantage where it's like I can't say comfortably that he's top tier, but I can't at the same time be like this dude tied to I wish I wish he was as heavy as he was in Brawl. Is he not? Dude. No, no, yeah, yeah. no, he's like he was like uh, second high, second heaviest in the game, right? Uh, like no, he wasn't that heavy. I thought he was, but he's like third. I think he was like he's definitely like top five yeah. heaviest. He uh, he pretty much like mostly got nerfed from the transition to this game. But as you can tell, doesn't matter. <laughs> Dude's a monster. He's got a lot of good tournament ter uh, tournament places. Uh, the so dude, let, I'm just gonna end it with this statement. He has up tilt. Yes, he does. Okay, Incineroar is gonna wow. be my next guess. Ooh, I'm excited to see this. Incineroar is my next guess. 
This is an odd combination though. Pit and Cinderor Pokemon Train. That's Wait, of, can you pick the like same character? It, it like let no. him hover over. Okay, I didn't know if it was. Yeah, okay. I mean, granted, you know, if I'm playing a uh, Marth, I can play, you know, <laughs> Marth I can play a Lucino. They put on Roy. You know, it's pretty much all the same thing. <laughs> But on Chrome, you know, it's like if you're playing like, them yeah. character, you're lucky enough to be able to. Yeah, if you play Fire Kid. Emblem, you play all of them. Except for, like, Robin, maybe. Who was up first? I didn't see it. Oh, Pit and Captain Falcon. Yeah. I see it. Pit and Falcon. Let's go. So we don't see a whole lot of Pits. Pit. Pit same, thing, same thing as Smash 4. Super honest. Doesn't really have anything to degenerate. Oh, uh, something happened. All right, and you know what? He is so confident in his gameplay, he does not need He's that first character. He's going straight to his last character. He's going straight to his last character. He knows he can win with just Pokemon Trainer. Pokemon Trainer is three characters in one. He's kind of cheating anyways. Dude has six or five characters. <laughs> five because I forgot. It's not six. It's the trainer himself doesn't just run out there and start beating the crap out of them. Well, that's a quick one over. from... Aha, uh -huh, I know, I know. I wonder what happened. I wonder what the... <laughs> My need is to reach to figure out how good Snake is. Bruh. We got years of research under our belt. Years of research, you know what that means? Oh, yes. Uh, yes I didn't see I was yeah. yeah, we got chat right there, my dude. Chat is like my lifeblood. You know, whenever I, I, I turn on a stream and I see chat, I'm just like, this is my people. <laughs> okay, except for, you know, those certain streams where it's like, okay, you gotta want to stay away from those. Did they change anything? Uh, Maybe the order? Let's find out. I think it's. It was Pit and Falcon. Yeah. No, he, okay, he wanted oh. Incineroar. Okay, so now the real question is, did he mean to do Incineroar at first? Or did he fake all that to be like, okay, <laughs> which like, my I'm characters? not playing Pit and the Falcon. <laughs> like, okay, which my characters do well against Incineroar? Although I think Pit and the Falcon would be really good for Pit. Yeah. Off stage. So right, this is going to be a super volatile matchup. I just, how did I not get this? L, L Tigre. He plays Incineroar. Uh, yeah, how, I how did I not get this? All right, uh, these counters aren't really, uh, you know, being too beneficial for him. But at the same time, you know, ooh, try to chase him on that side of me. Incineroar has some of the best tilts in the game. He really does. All of them. Seem to combo four tilts a very strong move. It kills very early in this game. That kills oh. early as well. <laughs> didn't kill, but it was scary. The body splash unfortunately didn't really do too much other than just kind of like harass him off stage. But you know that's kind of worth it. I love that. Raptor boost is such a fun. Ooh. Oh, oh the okay, I can guy. appreciate very that. Very smart. Very smart. Ooh, good, good. Uh, tech, tech read, I guess. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yep. All right. Throw him against the Alolan Whip, dudes. Out of here. Next up, we got Inkling. All right, how does Inkling deal with all this? By giving him revenge. And all right, and here's everybody's favorite part of the game. <laughs> all right, give me ba give me Bayo SD give me like Bayo back so I can SDI. I'm so tired of mashing everything. I know. I'd prefer to SDI Bayo combos for another game than like to mash out of everything that touches me. It's like they they purposely took out SDI. It's to replaced it with mashing. The big importance and replaced it with mashing, but only for you know this character pretty much. King K rule is not as it's not as bad. I guess it's well, still pretty. It's a I lot. Mean, if a character has a berry. You want to be able to mash out quickly so they don't get a follow up. Like yeah. Rob, QK Rule, except for Down Tilt, you know, because he recovers quickly from that. Is that better than Down Tilt, you think? Yeah. It's because uh, I the think it bears the same disc, same time wave, but K Rule recovers a lot quicker from Down Tilt than Down Throw. Oh, okay. It's just the Down Tilt's a lot harder to hit. Yeah. Oh, All right, that's so back it. to the game. Uh, so back to the game where uh, Inkling's dead. Mega Man. I love. I think this character is pretty good. I think he's way under. He's the same as in Smash 4. He's underrated because no one plays him as much. Because he's, he's very difficult. hard to, to master. He's, he's difficult. very difficult. He's technical, and you have to be a certain type of player to really want to play him. Because you can't just be your average Joe and be like, I'm going to learn Mega Man. That's I'm right. going to pick up Mega Man. How do I do anything? <laughs> no, that shit doesn't work. That doesn't work. But when he's mastered, he is. But when he's mastered, very you sit good. there and you're like, where did this 80% come it from? So and he's just sitting there <laughs> jumping a place, like shooting out lemons. It's like, get this mess off me. That almost. Good neutral, good upgrade. Ooh. Kept the jump. Kept the jump. That's smart. Up. Okay, wow. Not as strong as it was in the last game. Still very strong. Up tilt, coming out. Now, unfortunately, he's uh, got a whole other character. Now, I like that he's saying Charizard because he's able to live from these. So I don't know if he'll live from all of them. I was about to say he's going to go inside. Wow, that kill from a cross Blitz. stage. Just Flare Blitz is so strong. One sec. Okay, so ah, El Tigre is uh, definitely staying those characters. Did he even get to his last character? Who was it? Pit. It was Pit. It was Pit. Who was it? I thought yeah. uh, oh, the dude on the left, the one who won. Because remember he uh, only played. Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. His Incineroar died and then he won a Pokemon. Yeah, I didn't have his pit out. All right, so let's see who good old Spike switches to. Is he going to stay the same? He is. You know, confidence. You want that confidence. Now, is he going to start with the same character? Is the real question. I'm saying. 
Pit I'm, Mega Man. Easy money. I'm saying Incineroar Inkling. I'm always accurate. Pit Mega Man. You know, 50%. How do what I keep, what did you I, say? I, I, I said Incineroar Inkling. I was 100% <laughs> wrong. I didn't get either right. Dude, I'm not good at this guessing game. It's hard. It's hard. You gotta have a professional skill. All right, here we go with game two. We got Pit and Captain Falcon on board. Now, Pit in this game, he wasn't, like I said, he was very. Uh, you your foot. Yeah. Very uh, up, 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 honest go. and average in the last he's game. Fair and honest. Fair character. and honest. Uh, in this game, he's still fair and honest, but he has a, several improvements make him a much better character. His Nair, it's actually a, it's actually a move really now. Scary. It actually connects. Now, I see more pits than dark. Actually, no, I've been seeing more dark pits than pits, actually. I don't know why. Like, I guess just the strength? Um, I guess, I think a lot of, I know a lot of, I know a dude who plays Dark Pit, and he's like, I just want to bother aiming arrows. Now, oh, that is a true confirm, and that is yep. disgusting, and that makes me want to go home and drink myself, <laughs> like, out of commission. But you know what? I can appreciate it, because it's pretty wicked. He's That's, going for it. Oh. Uh -oh. Watch out. You're going to, you're right, at let's kill see. He's at 24.7%. Let's do some math. Like, oh, no, he oh, lost oh, it. Oh, he got grabbed. Uh-oh. Oh, good read. Oh, my oh, God. That, that was disgusting. Oh. Please. I want to watch video games, my dude. That I don't wanna... string was nasty. I did not know we were playing F Zero, my guy. Holy shit! They just uh, mm -hmm. three stock. Oh my lord, dude! Falcon is scary. So it's one one. Yes, it's one, one. So it's one one. That was a uh, that was a big turnaround. Make sure that's not us. Uh, I'm assuming we're going to stay with the same characters. Yep. All right. Same characters. Same characters. All right. Now, I've been 100% wrong at every time on who they start with, so I'm going to be right this time. I'm going to say Falcon Pit. You know, Pokemon Trainer Mega. No, Pokemon Trainer Captain. Easy. Look at that. Look I was at 50, that. I was 50% right. I wasn't 100% wrong. Uh, I had that. I'm on a roll. Okay, yeah, Dark Pit is less honest on WarioWare. Because that shit's just going to mess you up. Oh, he starts with Charizard. Okay. All right, all right. Starts off with Charizard against. I guess Charizard is favorite. I pictured Probably. the other two being a tough matchup. For I mean, Captain the dude's got Falcon. Charizard on his shirt. That is very. Yep, that is true. People. All right. <laughs> Dove straight into that, being like, claw me out, baby. Falcon doing his signature up air strings. I remember, you know, before the game came out, Zero was saying he had a video about Captain Falcon. He's like, I feel like Captain Falcon deserves his up air is so much worse. I'm sitting here, I'm like, this dude just got like five in a row. I know. I don't know. What, oh. <laughs> He's on points with me. Oh, that was cheeky. I love it, but that was cheeky. I could appreciate any super cheeky play like that. Unless it's against me. It had to be. He knew that was coming to He backed was, up. I don't know why he went for that. That was a big question. Jesus, oh my lord. Can he make? Yeah, he can make it. I'm surprised he didn't go for the cheeky play again and try to like hit him with the other. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I was thinking. It is fairly uh, even right now. If it wasn't 1 1 right now, I would uh, totally say do it. Does that move ever kill, by the way? So I, I do don't know, man. That guy looks re uh, he looks like he has a game. All right, so uh, still alive. Neither have died yet. Both hit really I'm sorry. Bad. Okay. Both at really high percent right now. Have a Facebook page, you say? It's on. What is it on? Giving them that great commentary, Craig says. All right, we are at, let's see, we have Pit and Captain. That's it. Yep, run up and up smash. All it takes. So now we've got Pit and Inkling. Here we go. Some people say Inkling is the best character in the game. I do agree. Very much so. Do you not agree with me? I think you're uh, you're shaking your head. What you do think so? Uh, what I miss. That's how I said I think Inkling was... Some people say that he is, uh, or she, I think they're more, she's yeah, a, he's the right. best character in the game. You know, I don't think there's a best, I don't think there's a, the best character, I think there's like, the three best characters. There are a lot of good characters. Who, who's your th three, you think? Besides? My top three would be, uh, personally? Yes. A lot of bias gonna be involved in this. Peach, Inkling, and Pichu. Peach, Inkling. I think, this, okay. again, personal bias. Uh, I forget about Peach, yeah. Uh, what's, what's, what's with the hype of Peach, man? What makes her so good? I have no idea, I'm just a brain dead person her, who listens all to all the top tier so players. So you know how short hop aerials, they do less percent than full hop aerials in this game. Oh, really? Yeah, they do. Wait, so they when do? she, mm -hmm. oh. like if you do the uh, if you do the the short the, the shortcut, you know, press jump, and they, they do less percent than normal. So with Peach, when she 
uh, float cancels and does an aerial. If you full hop float cancel, they do the normal percent. Her which aerials is not a big are good. Deal. Her aerials are insane. Uh, she's really safe. They're really fast. You can really good at edge guarding with uh, certain aerials. Turnips like, are good at edge guarding. Yeah, she is good all around. And she doesn't seem to struggle as much as she did in Smash 4 with a uh, sword character. She seems to be still <laughs> really good. She doesn't spawn against that death percent against Meta Knight anymore. <laughs> that's that's true. I forgot about that. That was, a, that was such a sad time. So. Oh, good. Wow, yeah. the raw side oh, did wow. not killing. Did not kill, but got close. Um, Spike's got a bit of a mountain to climb. All right, interesting. He does. It is doable though. You gotta be careful. This bit, uh, you know, he's he's kind of getting a little hungry for that kill. Don't got a lot of smashes. You know, kill moves. Very well and done. And he's man. dead. Next up is uh, Incineroar. He's gonna die in one hit. Yeah. Unless it's like one of those weak combos. Like down tilt and tough. yeah. Down tilt, forward air. Oh, oh now, yep, now All he's right. dead. <laughs> I don't think it matters uh, stay now. Stay away. Oh, dear lord. So if he gets the revenge and just gets a normal hit like that, it just does more damage, right? Not more knockback. If it's if he does what? If he does revenge and just does a normal hit. Not like it, a, it increases the hit damage and the knockback of the move. Oh, okay. But the strength of it is dependent upon the move that he's hitting. Okay, okay. With that really weird outward. That and should be it. Yep, well done. He's got that timing down, it looks and like. And it can stack. And it's, yeah, I saw that. He just did two of them. And is that LT there, Gray, that was LT Gray. Very well done, LT Gray. I appreciate some Incineroar gameplay because this cat is where it's at. Please I agree. kill me. Don't make me ever don't, don't me say, ever that, say again. that again. We're gonna have to talk never about let this me later. say that again. Uh, All right, I have no idea who, the, who is up next. And I could have sworn I saw somebody from my old Ooh, high yeah. school walking. We got a uh, Loco versus uh, Keiru. Okay. Loco versus Keiru. I can appreciate that. Now, did All we play right. against one of these guys? Uh, they got in the hat. I believe we did. Yes, I'm done. Who did and you play? Mm, this wasn't winner semis. I don't know. That's a good question. No, it wasn't winner semis. It wasn't? No. It was the game before that. No, okay. We're about to find out. Well, since you're so good at picking out characters and very good at predicting, let's see who you have. Who do you have? I'm trying to think of who we. I don't remember. No, he wasn't the villager. If I see a lineup, maybe I can. Was he the Roy? Ah, oh, he was either the Roy or the other. Yeah, I think he might have been Roy. Because that one game, it was Roy. It was Roy villager. Snake. It was Roy and villager. Yeah, was villager. That, yeah, he is Roy, I believe. Mike is probably driving about to play a doubles match. So. We're about to play a doubles match. I don't think I don't know if that's us. Oh, they're in losers finals now. There, we have uh, we have limbs versus dusk. I'm sorry, guys. Limbs versus dusk. Oh, okay. Yeah. What they say? They're in. They're in losers finals. Yeah, losers finals. So okay, we have one more cool. Set we we have one more set. Are you allowed to? You're allowed to use any co uh, combination. Is that everywhere? Is that in Genesis? Um, I believe so. Huh, I didn't know that. I know for here, I don't know about Genesis, but I know for here specifically. Any I want to say so for Genesis. Do they have to be the midweight? Me. I think they have to be a specific me, but it doesn't really matter. Okay. Like, be like, oh, you're using the lighter one! Well, because I know in Smash 4, there's, you know, he's broken for being, so, what, small? Was it well, the that small was brawl, me? That was the brawler. The small brawler me could kill you at, like, 20. Because he, like, the, the uppy or whatever it, it was. It was the flip yeah. into the uppy, like, super far off stage, but at the same time, it's like... Yeah. The, up the helicopter kick kills so much. Oh, like, I know. It is so weaker. <laughs> Apparently the me swordsman has a confirm off of good. tornado or something like that. Yeah, like sixty-five it's or like seventy-something. Tornado and uppy, I think. What's his uppy? Is that, oh, is it like link? The no, can't be. Yeah, it's a spinning up. Oh, is it really that good? All right, so uh, you know, I'm not. I'm dawn. gonna. I'm looking at this team on the left, and uh, <laughs> I didn't even mean to say when I said me swords fighter. I, didn't I don't want to sound mean at all, but uh, I think the helmet suits him. <laughs> All right, let's All go. Right, here we go. Game here one. Here we go. Game one. Limbs and Starting off with Dawn. the Mii Swordsman against the Game & Watch. You know, I'm personally, I'm a fan of decorating your Mii Swordsman, you know, making them look nice, but I can respect not doing that. That Chakram is stupid. If you do the slow one, it hits multiple times. Really? Yes. If you do the fast one, it doesn't. I had no clue. Now, I don't think the Swordsman has... You can't change the Mii's weight. Change the Mii's oh, weight. okay. So, I'm saying... Oh, oh I didn't thank know God. Could. Okay, yeah, for real. Left and thinks Peach is top tier. Oh, absolutely. That's very... Yeah. I didn't even know you could angle those, actually. You don't see many gaming watches in this game. His new, no, um, his new forward air. I, it's it's good, but it's also not. <laughs> it's sir, his back air sa serves the same purpose, but you have to have your back to them now. Also, his two two has been uh, not two two, just the up air. Has it been nerfed? It's, it yeah, like, it's seems like it doesn't so, carry up. It's so weak. Like, I've so. been I've been hit at like 120 like on the top, and I haven't died. Okay, that. he must have got some. Oh, uh, see, yeah, they just clanks. Oh my gosh, well done. Well, I mean, the up smash is still a thing. You yeah, know? Very, very very good option that all gaming watches do. Uh, All right, here my favorite Chrom, neutral, down tilt, down, down tilt, down tilt. But I can dig it though. Oh, tech read? Nah, I missed it. You missed the uh, no tech. 
This guy can't get a single bomb up. They just keep getting hit in the air. This dude's like, please, just let me. He's, just, my, yeah. he's trying to like play a snake. So my main goal is to blow up. Everybody else is like, no. Oh, That's, yep. that was very unfortunate. He lived though. That's. He's gotta be careful though. Dude's getting really close to dying. Boy. Promise swinging. Promise swinging, and he gets the hit. That four till is so now we're, two strong. now we're up to good old Ganon. Uh oh. Oh, very well done. That's it, yeah. Oh, that's yep. it. That, the he, boot. He does not come up with his sword, he comes up just himself before the sword comes. So there are several frames and when you can just you can just punish him with whatever you want to. It's very unfortunate. You know, I always say this to Simon, I'm like, oh, I just have special wool, but then I always, like, mistime it to where we just hit each other, and he's just like, Ugh. <laughs> he just lives. I feel like you can forward to, is that what, frame, 11 frames? Something like that? Uh, 13. 13 frames? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Gandalf just swinging with his foot everywhere, saying, <laughs> I don't care who's in my way. I'm an indiscriminate uh, committer. Uh, interesting option. Uh, I'm going to assume that latter half was unintentional, uh, but yeah, he wanted I to believe initially so. go down. Is that 1-0? Now, why does this man got, like, a straight nose? Look at that. That bugs me so much. It's like he could stab someone It's with very that. defined. It's very... Everything about Ganondorf is defined. Like, you can see his abs, like, through his shirt. And I... I'm like, this is a man that I want to take... I want him to take me home one day and cook me a nice dinner. <laughs> this Ganon design is much better. Who, what was it in Smash 4? What it, Smash 4 in Brawl, it was a Twilight Princess. It was. It and was in Melee and Ocarina, Princess. he was a good old, uh... What's it called? Ocarina time, dude. In Melee, yeah. I still wish you know he had magic. He could use magic, and when I say magic, I don't mean he just hit, like punches dark. Oh, like they do in the mods, and yeah, that was, that, that Ganon is really. Dude, please good. legalize PM mod, like PM Wizard Ganondorf. It's the <laughs> if you fully charge the neutral, but it does ninety percent. Are you kidding? Yes. Is it the same like length, like the same? No, no, no. It's not the punch. He like it, he's it's like the volleyball move. The volleyball move. I haven't played that in game Ocarina. so long. You know where he like shoots the orbs at you? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's the that's neutral B and PM. Yeah. Oh my. Well, in the modded version. In the, mod in the, yeah, in the yeah, normal, yeah. it's in the normal, it's uh, the cape, I think. Gerudos have strong noses. Yeah, they do. Dude, I appreciate anybody with a strong nose. It's like having a good defined nose is really hard to pull off That's... genetically. All right, but enough about noses. Oh, okay. You know, we got Ganon. We <laughs> no, got to yeah, keep, keep talking about noses here. So uh, Ganondorf is using his uh, neutral nose. <laughs> like this I feel like one, one oh, hit for common. Funny. Oh, good read. He could be dead. He's dead. No. Nope, if, nope. if he does, if he reads it right, yep. Ooh, yep. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well dead. done. So uh, yeah, this is why people uh, kind of aren't playing Chrom too much anymore because uh, that happens. Yeah. When you can get that easily edgeguarded by Ganon, or you know there's something wrong. Uh, yeah. You should probably switch. <laughs> and now when I say easily edgeguarded, I mean it's not they just run off and do a hard break down air. I mean they just run off and down air. And you're just dead. No matter if you what. can just sit there on stage and forward smash, you're uh, <laughs> probably. <laughs> you should probably uh, switch. Or have a secondary, I guess, because Crown is very, landing still option. very now, good. Now, see, not a lot of people know. I'm a connoisseur about the Mii Swordsman back in Smash 4. Oh, yes. My Mii oh. Swordsman was a... Uh, I forgot about that. Yes, you were. My was favorite move on him is the uh, down air. Oh. The down air. Oh, yes. Unfortunately, he snapped the ledge with that up so he didn't get the last hit, which probably would have killed, because Lynx can do that, but Mii Swordsman doesn't look like he can. All right, what's he going to do to Edge Guard? He needs to just run off and hit him, my dude. People gotta stop being so afraid about running off. I'm playing the si I play Simon and I run off stage all the time and I'm like, let's swing it, my guy. Yeah, it's uh it's something in this game that people will still have to get used to, because it's like it's it's a better like if the option. Ganondorf in this is game. going off stage to Edgar you, but you're not going off stage to get guard the Endorf. There's something something here. And you know, just boot that's, almost kills. Oh, that's so strong. Will we get another raw raw down beat by Ganon? Maybe, right. but uh Ooh. that should be it. Yeah. He's dead too, oh, he's dead but well. he takes out ah. the uh, Ganondorf, which is giving him the most trouble. Now he's playing a center against Game Launch. This is this probably could the go one of two ways. <laughs> this is like the wonkiest thing I've ever seen. This dumb wrestler cat versus this stupid two-dimensional little monster. I'm surprised oh he doesn't my. change animation when he does the. Uh, what a good! Oh my, he is keeping him in the air. He's, a, he's not letting him come on the stage for anything. He's like, hey, he's there. That's ah. nice, Reed. That That's not was oh, that is it. That pretty is damn good. Good read. Dude just lit up the torch. He's even a fire type. He didn't get destroyed by that. <laughs> Come on, man. We value type disadvantage and advantages. Oh, did you sign up for singles? Uh, yeah, I did. I did when I signed up for doubles. Right, cool. Yeah, yeah, because I, I, I was smart. I did online signing. So instead of paying 21 like you chumps, I paid 19. Oh man, that's a huge discount. I got to do oh, that next yeah. time. 
The best I part is, I get to keep this $20 bill in my pocket. How'd you do it? Just like their, their website or their. Yeah, Smash GG. Smash GG? Okay. You can pre register on there. I did not know you could do that. Yep. It's really handy. If you don't go, could you get your money back? Uh, I would got, Guys, I kind of want to give a quick plug to ourselves, you know what I'm saying? You know, uh, going that Brawl. Uh, this is our monthly Smash uh, Ultimate Tournament. This is our second one. And uh, we have about 120, 130 people here today. Um, yeah. I think 120 some people for the singles tournament. So it's uh, still coming out pretty strong, man. New game, new blood. Everybody's uh, awake again. Oh yeah. I guess uh, Smash Four. Crawling out from the caves. Yeah, man. Like, um, just, just hyped to see all these people come out here for this game, man. It's yeah, shout out to you guys for having this great event. You know. Yeah, man. It's really well organized too. And I really like that. I think we'll definitely be making our way over here more often. Thank that's you for guys. sure. Thank you Absolutely. Guys. Definitely. It um, is very nice here. Yeah. Uh, shoot. As long as I don't drive. Follow us on the following social media below twitch.tv slash gbdojo. Our archives are always there. You know, if you catch yourself on stream, you know, let's run through the matches. And we also upload on YouTube, so youtube.com slash Gwinnett Brawl. And follow us on Twitter and Facebook down below, you know, to keep up with our events and what's coming up. I believe our next fighting game, like, monthly will be. Uh, I know it's the weekend, right? The, the weekend, right when Kingdom Hearts 3 comes out. I, I don't remember. Ugh. Oh, is that the, soon? The 26th. Yeah, it'll be Saturday. The it 26th. comes out the 26th. No, it comes out. No, it comes out. It comes out the next day or the previous. It comes out that Friday in Japan, and then Dear it comes Lord. out in America. I didn't realize on how soon that was. That's so nice to hear. Dude, I, like I in my head, it's like months and months away. I thought. I thought yeah, I'm sitting here and it's like Kingdom Hearts 3. Yeah, that, that mess is like another like four months away. It's this month. <laughs> it's this month. Holy cow! I said the same thing. I'm so excited. Dude, I can't wait to beat up Heartless with Buzz Lightyear at my side. <laughs> <Yes>. That man <laughs> is my. Hero. Fun fact, did you know in Kingdom Hearts 2 that they already had Woody and Buzz models in the game because they thought they would probably get the rights to use them, uh, but um, but they didn't, they didn't they didn't clear, so they just kind of left them in the game. But, you know, really? about 13 years later, hey, we finally got them. You know, so theoretically, if I was really good at modding and stuff like that, I could get, like, a ROM hack of Kingdom Hearts 2, go in there, and replace every model in the game with Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> theoretically, yes. Theoretically, I could. could. I would like that. You know, Sora, Roxas, the Fated Duel, it's just two Buzz Lightyears. Are all these setups, they belong, all, all these setups, do they belong, uh, they belong uh, here? I see all the, the majority, majority of the setups, will, um, we, we, sp we, spend a, we spend a really good amount of money that on a lot of setups here. And we also have Momocon, shout out to Momocon for sponsoring us. Shout out to Momocon. Yeah. Like the yeah, Switches man. too, or just the, no, the monitors? Switch, switches and monitors. Oh, wow. Yeah. There's a lot of setups, you'll see the owned yeah. by Momocon stickers. There are yeah, man, definitely. a lot. Momocon being, um, Definitely cool you know, and uh, a shout out to Wasteland Gaming for letting us use this awesome venue. Absolutely, so it's a very nice venue. We have Affinity. This is a loser's bracket match. This is loser bracket. Yeah, I, think, I think we're waiting for uh, Fatality to finish his uh, doubles match. Dude, I think um, you guys are maybe coming up. With okay, we're gonna play on here. I'll do it. Yeah. All right. So I like this. Ugh. We got my boy Ridley up here. He's last character. Where is he? Oh, okay. But we got Affinity back up here. You know, strong playing the Animal Crossing characters as well as the actual animal. Had a really strong showing against uh, Fatality. And now he's playing against Affinity. He was playing a pretty weird mishmash of characters, you know. Not something I thought would really vibe well together, but hey, who knows? Maybe it does. Luigi, Wario, and Ridley. Grant. Uh oh. Sorry about that. Charging the up smash on there. <laughs> Bill just is like, hey, how about no? What do you think about Luigi in this game? Do you think he's nerfed, or do you think he's just as um, fine as he was in Smash 4? I'm terrified. You're ter I, yeah, I don't you think he, I don't <laughs> think he's amazing, but when I play against a Luigi, I'm just gonna sit on any platform I can for the If you have like the wrong character matchup, you are, uh, it's gonna be bad. Like, I'm just gonna sit there and I'm like, I'm not going near you at all. The second I see you running up to me, I'm gonna throw out a move. Yep, yep. That grab is scary. See, also, ooh, okay, I don't know what it is, it. but the way trick. about how Luigi runs in this game just like tilts me so hard. Oh, it's very mean. Yeah, he just kind of like puts one foot, just boom, boom. It's because it's like, it's like he's not even running at you to fight you. It's like, it looks like he's gonna run at you and then just trip on you and like steal your money. But in reality, he does 80 damage when he runs. Well, up speaking to of me. scumbags, we got Wario here. Now, this, he? this character is uh, a surprise, surprisingly good character. You know, Reflex, a really well-known player from Georgia. I he's Georgia. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Gluttony, you know, one of the hands down probably like one of the best. And you've you know, got Tweak showing out in uh, well, Let's Make Moves, I believe, was the tournament. Moves, yeah. Getting first, played Wario him. there. I, now, I don't know if that was Wario or if it was Tweak. Oh, it, it was. It, I say it was both. Tweak is. Just I would say it's probably mostly insane. Tweak, but you know Wario. But Wario is a lot better in this game, I believe. His movement is incredible. 
he benefits from the system mechanics so much. Dude has a lot of good killers. That forward tilt. I can't even oh, picture yeah. his forward tilt in the last game. Like, is that the same? It, it, it was actually just it was just a weak. It was just oh, it was a, a punch. punch. He just this guy big. Yeah, that's yeah. right. It is very uh, good. Also, listening. his up smash if you pause on it is the most terrifying thing in the world. When oh, that's right, because like, his head is the mind. size of the stage. Yeah, it's, it's very scary. But his nair having a landing hitbox is. And the uh, secondary hitbox on it is really strong. Really, yeah. That's uh, it. I don't know if he meant to do that. A little bit of questionable to stay on a Lloyd Rocket when approaching. There's muscle and bustle behind us. Yeah. We're going back to the map. All right, we got our boy Ridley We got here. some heavies. Now, this is a character I am a huge fan Connoisseur of. Connoisseur of, yeah. Your Ridley is very good. I think uh, his, uh, I don't know the name of it, uh, the neutral beef? Do you know what that the is? Fireballs. Pl it, fireball. it, it, plasma fire. Plasma, plasma fire. fire I think that is an incredible ledge guard. One of the best ledge guarding moves in the game. Pro probably the best ledge guarding special. Special. Like itself? Yeah. yeah, I agree. I don't know about overall moves. Because then you've got Snake and, and uh, well, Simon Nikita, who are also good. Yeah, Nikita. And, Nikita yeah. may be better. Yeah. But other than forward that, smash, it's very okay, good. Yeah. Ridley forward smash is one of the strongest. All right. Does not have much cooldown either. Now see, one of, so some of the big downsides about Ridley. First mm -hmm. off, yep. his advantage state is pretty bad. And surprisingly, not a lot of people know this, dude doesn't do a lot of damage. Does he really not? I, haven't he even, I just assume he does a lot. <laughs> uh, okay, I say that as that, six, as that backer did 16%. But, you know, in jet... That's... He did not uh, mash. Uh, oh, no, it kills Ridley first? No, it kills first? Ridley first. It kills Ridley first. Even if you don't mash out? Like Even if, if you don't mash out. That's All weird, suicide moves like that, all suicide command grabs, kill the initiator first. Really? Ganon yeah. yeah, I knew they all Ganon that. side, Bowser side, Ridley side, it all kills them first. Now, That's stuff crazy. like Ike and Brock from up B. All right, sorry for being for terrible TO, but who won that first game? <laughs> it was uh, Affin? Uh, the, the Affinity, yeah. Yeah, Affinity. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys, I did. Yeah, That's you could good. be good. Walk away for a second. <laughs> so, you know, in a situation like that, you kind of want to let go of them at the last moment, and you pressure them with an aerial. You got two jumps, you can do an aerial, and you can come back. Yeah, because really doesn't really have a good uh, B. His recovery is good distance. It's a huge hitbox. It's really strong. Unfortunately, the downside is it's super linear. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can really only go in one direction with it. And some characters can abuse that, uh, but some can't, you know? And the ones that can't, hey, you're safe. So going back to this, um, last match I started with, what was it, Luigi versus Villager. But now we're having to DK out instead. So two boys who love to get in each other's face and do like grab combos and stuff like that. But I think Luigi's grab combos are a little scarier. Yeah, they're they're kind of they're terrifying. scarier, but DK has better norms. It's yeah, DK is, DK is so Ooh, much shield like on that Luigi Ding down Dong's gone, but he is such a good character in this game. If you see uh, like the Luigi or Dr. Mario landing with that downbeat, you got a whole shield all the way, my dude. Oh, That's he's doing it. Be it. No, he's gonna hit him. Yeah, there well you done. Go. Good edge Don't go too low. Yep. Well yep. done. Well done. Good edge guard, good edge guard. We have not Ridley. Oh, back to the heavies. Here we go. All right, Ridley, Ridley time. Let's go. Dude, if he force matches, he's dead. Or, you know, he's just going to get duffed in just his Just with it. <laughs> <laughs> Got to be careful about using that side being neutral. You miss, you're taking a free punish. Yeah. It has to be a hard race. Oh, oh unfortunately. Had the idea that Duncan was going to try to jump the pressure with an air, but instead just gets clapped. Yeah, and, oh, oh. I went for the stage spike. Good Mix tech. up? I can appreciate that. Unfortunately, was gonna go for, yeah. Oh, went nowhere. Surprising, he didn't go any further. I think he didn't. Yeah, he didn't jump off and he go. He could have drifted yeah. a little further. I mean, that would have killed. Whatever. Really dash that. Strong, scary. Fast, have you ever paused the game? If you pause the game when he's doing it. The dude it like unhinges his jaw like a snake. It's so creepy. Oh, such a good move. Run off an edge guard. Yeah. You're playing Ridley. Nair, especially. It's like, isn't it really disjointed or pretty disjointed? Oh yeah, his Nair is like one of the best Nairs in the game. Yeah. All right. Oh. For anybody who's looking to play Ridley, if they're off stage and they have recovered like DKs. Run off in there. Run off in there or up air. Yep, get out of shield air or forward air. There's a very good move. If you're not gonna do any of that. Shoot some fireballs. You know, don't try to just two frame them. Edge guard them. Yeah. It's yeah, cooler, yeah, he could have spam fireballs right there, and he would not have. Probably would have. All right, Wario slapping the dude. Buenos dias, DK. <laughs> All right, now we got the Isabel coming in, cheering with the bomb bomb. So cute. Oh well, I say that. All right, dust <laughs> up that disgusting man. So this is a very interesting neutral. They're kind of just jumping around each other, throwing aerials. Five blew up. Is he going to eat any of the pieces? No, he doesn't. Oh, can he heal from all the pieces? Or yeah, you, uh, most of them. Oh, oh, he turned around. He said, nope. Dude, saw that and was like, not nah, miss me with that. That almost Such killed. a good move. All right, this is very dangerous. Now, the downside is, so there's a big downside about playing Wario and Squad Strike. What's that? He's not gonna have his fart. That's that. Yeah. He doesn't true. charge up when he's not in here. I how long does it take to charge up? I know. Is about it like three minutes. Or two minutes. It's two two minutes. Min I think it's two minutes. Is it two minutes or, or percent based? 
It's two minutes, but it increases every time he like bites or eats something. Them. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's very accurate. I didn't think about that. Yeah. So that's an unfortunate side about playing Wario on Squatch Strike. Because uh, he's not going to have his waft. Because it generally takes hat, like yeah. most of your whole stock to get to, yeah. And he just used it. Unless you were to like try to time and him back out. Throw, yep, and he's it. out of very there. Very strong back throw. Uh, is that a 2-0? That's 2-0 for Affinity. Affinity. GG's. On stream, we've got LAK and Loco coming up. LAK and our ow. God, Jesus Christ, I held my arm on here. <laughs> yeah, like I was like holding my arm on here, and I guess since it was like I don't know if it was sweating, but it was getting. You know the one you like you keep your, like your arm or hands on something, and then you move it, and it feels like it's peeling off. Oh yes, yes, fair. Yeah, it did yes. that, but I just ripped it off. <laughs> there they go. Lax and Loco. All right, I don't know who either of these two play. I don't know anything about either of them. Oh, one plays uh, either Rob or Toon Link. I know that. Granted, you know, I'm not from Georgia, so I wouldn't know these people. There's some very, very friendly people over here in Georgia. Oh, yeah. Very good players as well. <laughs> they are so good here. Oh, yeah. Good competition over here. We got some good competition in Alabama, too. The oh, downside yeah. is we're all so far away from each other. Yeah. So getting everybody at the same tournament is difficult because everybody pretty much has to drive two-plus hours to tournaments that aren't in their own city. Yeah, the majority of all the players in... Alabama or up in the north, uh, Huntsville, Birmingham Huntsville, area. Birmingham so, yeah. areas. We're from like the middle. That in Mobile. That's either the very north or the very yeah, okay. south. Okay, Mobile does isn't, for some reason, Mobile and the southern half, like the lower southern half of Alabama, just don't count. They're they just don't not, travel. They're just not a part. They're just not a part of the Alabama. They don't state. travel, but they have 60-man so tournaments, so it's kind of weird. It's because Florida. They're uh, like they're like in this weird conjunction with Florida. I didn't think about that. Yeah, Florida's got some good really good players as well. You know, every, everywhere has got good players. Except maybe like, I don't know, North, North Dakota. Dakota. Whoa, are we about Yo, to say the same, about to say the same thing? thing. North Dakota. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> Everyone picks on North Dakota for their being Dude, like, no wonder North we're doubles partners. <laughs> I know. <laughs> North Dakota or Delaware, because you know what? P nobody exists in Delaware. Forget Delaware just State. I haven't heard that name in a long time. All right, here we go. All right. Oh, K. Rule. Oh, yes, I get to see some K. Rule action. Simon. Simon. I bet you're happy. Rob? There yeah, he is. I'm happy. Oh, yeah, this guy. I remember this guy. Yeah, he was yeah, playing yeah. Simon and Robert. Yeah. Yo. We're up. All right, everybody, we're out. Oh, sweet. Commentary now brought to you by CR2 Korean Panda here at Gwyn and Brawl. We in the middle. Uh, what are we, losers round five? Winners quarterfinal. We're in winners corner, uh, quarterfinals. Loco versus Lack. Lock. Help me out with the name here. Okay. Oh, I like that. Lack Cadillac. Got it. So we got a Belmont versus King K. Rule. I'm not too familiar with uh, with how squad striking works. To my understanding, it's kind of like hey, if a character dies and the next one comes in until you run out of characters. Uh, you know, as a Belmont, he's his zoning character. He's going to want to stay within whip and uh, projectile range. He takes the crown. Doesn't want to give it back. Oh, he got it back anyway. Ugh. Guaranteed? Yeah, that's guaranteed. I think uh, after that, he can get a jab, 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 or up tilt. Not sure what does more damage. But those are guaranteed. He can go for smash, but smash isn't. Up tilt on the platform, trying to poke him through it. Oh. Do your chain hang low? Do it wobble to the flow? Do we shine in the light? Okay, let me stop. Yeah, did you see that meme with the, uh, I think Richter like whipping like the black villager? Did you, have you seen that? No, one? I did not oh, see that. Oh, I gotta show you that one. <laughs> that was, that's messed up, but it's funny. All right. All right, so the matchup changed a little bit. It looks like Lack is very uh, like zone projectile heavy player. Because now we went from Belmont to, to Rob, both long distance characters. K. Rule's a big body, so he can, you know, he's practically a tank. He can take some damage. Um, he's expected to live up to uh, Rage percent, which he's at now. Yeah, Rage is activated at 120. Here we go. And he's hard to kill off because that up, he comes all the way up. Oh, nice trade. That trade is in Rob's favor. Oof. That extended hitbox below him spikes him. That's pretty good. I like that. That, uh, that counter up beat. And then we go to Luigi. Interesting choice for a Loco. 
We're from King K. Rule to uh, Luigi. Are we going to see the, 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 the throw death combo? The zero to death? Well, it wouldn't be zero to death because he has 70, 71% now, but we're going to see some death setups? Probably not. Oh, those down tilt spams. You, you, you. I got this pressure at your feet. At that point, you got to want to try to tilt your shield downward a bit to avoid getting uh, shield stabbed. Shooting some uh, projectiles, but uh, Rob can out spam uh, Luigi in a projectile game. Nice down smash. Ooh, forward smash, bringing that shield down some. Shield pressure by Rob. Shooting the wrong way. I don't know what he sees over there in the crowd. It must be someone he didn't like. This is for not believing me, Dad. Oh, we chopping. Trying to get him to like back up off the ledge a little bit. Or maybe he's just impatient, just wants to press buttons on the way down. Oh, down there for it. Oh, nice. Projectiles. <laughs> Are you serious? Stop. Get that out of my face. I'm commentating. <laughs> All right. Anyway. Oh, Rob, recovering from stage. I don't know what move that was. I guess it's near. Yeah, yeah it's got to be near. Shooting him at the ledge from full distance. Tried, I think he tried to get him before he snapped. I like the way uh, Loco is bringing, like, coming back on the stage with the, ooh. And now we're down to, oh, I get it. When, yeah, I see the stocks down there, so that's how it works. Yeah, it's just like KOF. All right, so now we're down to Wario. Wario versus Rob. Oh, wait, no, I got the names mixed up. Loco is Rob. Locke is Wario. Loco has a character left. Locke's down to just a Wario. He's already at 68%. You know, Rob can be difficult to deal with, too, because he has so many tools to use for him. He's got the Beyblade. He's got the lasers. He's got good aerials. Look at this. He's, he's very frustrating to fight. Oof. Didn't even get to the final character. So how does this work? Does is it two out of three? Yeah, two out of three. Two out of three. Okay. Yeah, it's the same rule besides you know the KOF. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, with with seventy something plus characters, I did, I like the idea of, of Squad Strike. I like that. Look, they even got like the the KOF two thousand. What is that? Two nineteen ninety nine uh, layout right there. Yeah. Uh, it's uh, it's pretty neat. I, li I like this. Yeah, I do too. Now, what if you could have, you know, do like Marvel and have like that and then your assist? Oh, no, that'd be crazy. Smash. That would be so crazy. I would, I, I, would, I would legitimately play. Well, there is a character that can do that, and that's Pokemon Trainer. Man, he, he, no, but he calls one, he gets one Pokemon, it's, but he doesn't assist me while I'm fighting. Oh, yeah, you should. Yeah. Me. Yeah, you're right. All right, so it was Young Link we didn't get to see, right? No? I, I can't really see who that last character is. Something happened? Uh, yeah, I think um, wrong name or something. Oh, OK. Yeah. Oh, he didn't, he didn't set his name. OK, he didn't set the name. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. Just, you know, kill ourselves. Because I don't think I think I took off the uh, pause setting. Nobody uh, accidentally pauses. Yeah, good job. No, seriously, that's messed up, dude. <laughs> that is messed up. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see the anime, though? Castlevania uh, anime? Oh, yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I saw it. It was tight. I yeah, oh, it's so good. I can't wait for season three. Yo, when Dracula and Alucard were slugging it, woo! Yeah, bro. Uh, I can't wait. I heard they're making, I heard he's the one that's going to be behind the Devil May Cry and, uh, like, show on Netflix. Yeah. And, uh, supposedly, maybe is the... It so, is it an anime, or is it, like, a, uh, or is it, is it a live-action show? There, there's already an anime for Devil May Cry, so yeah, I don't I, I, know. I remember that one. I mean, I wouldn't mind if they redo it again. You know what? You know what Netflix needs to do? Yeah. Berserk. You're right. They, they need to do Berserk. <laughs> I was watching uh, Devil May Cry, baby, and I was like, yo, Netflix should do Berserk. They would do it so much justice. I like this uh, other um, Berserk anime that was straight garbage. Yeah. All right. So this time, we got Loco starting off with Toon Link to fight, uh, to fight King K. Rule. I don't know if it's just because he wants to. Yeah, I guess he just wants to keep him out. So, I mean, why else would you pick Toon Link? I feel like I feel like Young Link is much stronger, or not much stronger. I feel like Young Link 
is a much more dominant between the two, between Young Link and Toon Link, but I don't know. Maybe maybe local just feels uh uh oh, pick up the crown? No, he's just gonna keep him away from it. Very smart. Very smart. Then he's gonna pick it up. Throw it up, down away, he throws it away. Oh, he, he was expecting to snap, but he didn't. He gets punished for it. Now he has to recover again. Ooh, nice bomb recovery. Gets him with the boomerang, but you know, armor all day on like every move. That is guaranteed. Oh, oh, we rolling. Rolling, 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 rolling. King K. Rule trying to cover the ledge the best he can, throwing the crown. Uh oh. And Loco using bombs to keep a. Uh, oh! Is that what we're doing? Okay. Ooh, belly has armor. Any move where he sticks out his belly has. Uh, I don't know if it's super armor or if it's just like regular armor, but it does have armor on it. So you gotta be careful of those. Uh, even when you think that you got disjointed hitbox, or if you think that you will win on win on the trade, there's that whole armor property. Ooh, nice shield pressure, but gets clapped. Netflix don't make anime. We know they don't actually make anime. Yeah. Yeah, they, they whatever. They help power. Uh, did you watch a new Baki? I didn't. I heard it was Wait, oh, wait, wait, that martial arts? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't watch it. I've seen I, I clips. Heard, I heard it was pretty decent. It is, it is. I need to, uh, I need to watch it. I, I but, do too. Uh, yeah, Netflix produced um, a, uh, a Berserk anime, a new, like a new like 2D animated one. I would definitely give them all of like, I don't know, all of my money for the rest of my life. Just take my nine, take my $10 a year. Right. <laughs> take my $10 a month, I'm good. Right, you know what I'm saying? Ooh. That fast fall in there gets punished. Ooh, down B. Uh, unexpected down B, so it gets clipped by it. Has to, has to eat the rest of the hits. Grab into laser. Is that a kill? No, it's not. Beyblade, lasers. Luigi having to do all of this Toho schmup dodging off the screen. Ooh, Beyblade at the ledge and then covered the roll distance? Huh? Yeah, it was. That's what I'm saying. That was, that was so smart. He covered two, two options. He was like, I'm going to cover you right here. I'm going to cover you over here at the same time. Up air. Uh, up air. Uh-oh. Is that a death? Yep, that, he accidentally air dodged to the side and killing himself. Or maybe he just felt like playing with a Belmont. If, I, that'd be the excuse. I mean, no, I did that on purpose. I, mean, I was just wanting to play a Belmont. I would have chose Richter, but I mean, you know, Simon's cool too. Oh, getting combo? We got combos. Rawr. He's going to eat his cross, throw some... It's not holy water in his case. It's fire? Axe. It's like PK fire, but it always activates. It doesn't have to hit anything. Which is pretty cool. Nice tether. Has the use forward air back there to activate that. Dive kick? No. Oh, we, we, we doing stuff. Staying at the range he wants to be. He tries to nair to get a decent punish. Misses the opportunity. Oh, woo -hoo! Motorcycle into four tilt. Whip combo. Let's go. Cross. We got projectiles. Wario dodging in with the down there. Well, he doesn't technically dodge, but he's like bobbing and waving midair. His aerial drift is so good. He's got like almost maybe even better than Jigglypuff uh, aerial drift. There's a lot of characters with good aerial drift. Palatina, Yoshi's is actually really darn good. Hey, Darvell, what's good? I am having a good time. Watch the Smash Ultimate here, Gwyneth Brawl. Make sure you take that twitch.tv slash GB Dojo and share it with the Facebook group. Yeah, there we go down there, but too high percent to combo into anything. So we're going to keep going with the projectiles, making it difficult for uh, War to capitalize. He's going to eat a couple of those to to, <laughs> to heal a few, a few little, oh, that's game. A dash my, my attack man, does My it. man was going to do all that lame stuff. He was like, nah, bro. <laughs> right? Yeah, you know, I'm tired of this. <laughs> <Ooh>. Hey! <laughs> I got to hustle in there, man. That was some good stuff. Shout out to my boy Go Goji over there. Ah, let's see your two family. Uh, okay. I'm saying. Yo, man, these these uh, these Belmonts, man, they be just chucking all this stuff, they're, bro. They're so good. They, got, they have great. Oh. Um, they got they got the range. They yeah. got they got all this holy water, holy water axes, and all this stuff. Right, the it. holy water setup. They have their four tilts are safe too, so it's like you can just whip it back and forth all day. Is it like just a like a little poke with the whip? It's a po four tilt. It's just whoosh, and it's safe. Yeah. This many character spaces away, like I think it's the longest. Is it, is it slow though? Is it like slow to make no, up for? No, it's fast. It's Why? I don't know how many frames it is, but it's just it's literally just. Uh, yeah, I know. It just comes out so quick. It's, it's safe. 
Yo, and then even better, right? You know that little hold water they got? Yeah. If they space it right at the ledge, you can make it activate on the ledge, and then the flames or the water, whatever, the burst will drop from the stage, like down onto the into the abyss oh. to cover the ledge. Yeah, there's a way to do that. That's crazy. Uh. What's up, Gwen and Bro? Hey, what's up, viewers? I see you, Chris. What's that? Crispy and salty? Crispy and salty, like French fries. All right, I so guess, I think right? uh, we're gonna probably finish up squad strike on this stream, and then we're gonna take the brunt of singles and close out with it. Going for smash with this six frame forward smash, please. Crispy and salty with the two. Uh, uh, here in the chat. Is that this Cami music? Is it? Yeah. Is it it Cammy? Is. Yeah, Cami's actually my main street fighter. When I used I mean, to. I still don't like that character, regardless. <laughs> yeah, she's. Of all the characters that are busted, she's busted in an honest way. No. Yeah, she is. No. Yeah. <laughs> she has to get in your face first. Exactly, but it's three by five. All right, anyway, uh, we're doing it again. It looks like it's the same order ish, pretty much. It's definitely the same characters, it looks like. Toon Ling versus King K. Rule. We're going to try to out zone them, stack up the damage. Once we get them off, we're going to drop bombs to make them pay for up being back to the ledge. And then if he does succeed, he'll pretty much be at death percentage. I think that's a plan anyway. For the most part, working out well. No. King K. Rule's a big body, so he can bring it back. Ooh. That bomb could have uh, broke his own shield. I think that, yeah, I think it can uh, ricochet up right off your own shield. Oh, no. Maybe not. The explosion definitely can help hurt it. Anyway. Bomb. Ooh. I don't like that the crown is, like, persistent. Like, even if you hit it, it doesn't stop or, like, change the trajectory of the crown so it's still a threat even if you attack it whatever if it if it's in the way of something gets reflected well if it's reflected it's reflected but it's like an unstoppable force of nonsense anyway boomerang got some arrows out there I'm trying to trying to build this damage up trying to get that that kill hit at 100 and almost 50 percent oh no confirm uh, he's rage percent too so anyone could die you know, he's at 150. Link is, is light and at 120. And against King K. Rule, the big body. Now comes in the the raw. I almost messed up and said Belmont. I almost got the characters in the name switched up again. Now comes in the raw. Or Tazbot. Did you watch GDQ? Oh, man. They had Tazbot, which was like a little Rob toy. And they had like an AI program for him. And he was playing like a bunch of games using tool assisted uh, programs. It was cool. Anyway. Uh, Taz by going, <coughs> taking that stock. Now we got Loco coming in. Oh, sorry, Locke coming in with Luigi. Rob trying to find a safe spot to come down in on. There he goes. Luigi at the corner now. Falls down with an air to retaliate. Avoids the Beyblade, but not the laser. Has to deal with the Beyblade again. Oof. Throws the Beyblade down at the ledge to get a reaction out of Luigi and read it properly. Good play. Very good play by Loco. Stacking up a lot of damage. Got Luigi close to 100% almost already. Beyblade, laser. A lot of long range pressure. Luigi has to get in. He only has green fireballs, which doesn't count for a lot in terms of long distance. And in fact, it fades away after a while. Oh, but he does have a tether grab. Gets an up air confirmed. Not a guaranteed kill off of a throw. But at lower percents, he does get combos or a zero to death. Oh. Covering the ledge, throwing a bunch of stuff. It's, it's hard out here. It is hard out here. Smash singles will start in about 10 minutes or so after this match. Catches the Beyblade during a down air. Up B. Doesn't get two frame. Falls down with an air but gets punished for it. Grab? No. That back throw almost killed Rob. But I don't, I guess his weight class saved him? Question mark? I'm not sure. Laser. Good aim. Tried to spike him. Miscalculated a little bit, but hey. Can't get them all, can we? And that's the whole point like with the new Smash games, right? We're trying to we're trying to increase survivability so people can have more fun and you know, not rage over some crazy losses. Oof. It's lasered. We should be having a hard day. This is death. Alright. Now comes Wario. Raw that rage percent. He still has projectiles. Oh, eat that. Says, oh, 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 oh. Why? Why was that a thing? 
Did you did you see that that DC combo? What? Uh. And Rob is finally out of there. And now we bring in Simon Belmont. Simon Belmont is going to play the long range game. Warrell's already at disadvantage at 104%. Well, disadvantage until he gets 120 and gets rage. Motorcycle is broken. Up there. We got we got Holy Fire. I guess. I guess we call it Holy Fire. We throwing them Castlevania items at him. Oh, we walk it back and forth. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, gets the bite. Edgeguard unsuccessful. Now he's at the point he's gonna have to prepare to fight the long range game again. Ooh, motorcycles and rides into the night right through all of it. Uh oh, Ugh. that was the four tilt. That right there. That's the four tilt. I thought Gal theme was about to hop on for a second. <laughs> Yo, that'd be so dope. I did ask. Um, I did put um, the Guile theme up um, higher, and Loco just you know commenting on the uh, Rob oh, yeah. the, the base blade combo. <laughs> Yo, that was sick. I didn't know. I, that I'm was, asking about the. I didn't know that was a thing. Everybody, we're at Metro Atlanta's premier local fighting game tournament, Duluth, Georgia. Winner brought right here, Wasteland Gaming. Make sure you share that link at twitch.tv slash gbdojo. Tweets out at gbdojo as well at twitter.com slash gbdojo. You can find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Brawl. We post regularly when we're about to have tournaments, post-tournament dates, events. All right, so um, I think we're going to have uh, Nova Pixel versus uh, Loco, who just won his match on stream. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, local stays, and we're going to have Nova Pixel. I mean, all right, he didn't even know that was going to work out, too. So, you know, <laughs> just, you know, hit them in the shins uh, until, you uh, know, they fall. It's crazy out here. Yeah, it is, man. It's a... Uh, Saturday, man. I think we got like 120 some people for uh, Smash singles right now. We're about to even with plus two on block going on. No, plus two is mainly doing fighting game stuff. Okay. Like, uh, well, the general, like traditional fighting game. Traditional stuff. fight. Okay. So. And um, I think there there is a um, thousand dollar hot bonus tournament in Savannah, if I'm mistaken. So yes. I know some of the cats went there. Yeah, I saw that. But we're really glad to at least have this many people come out, show out. I was about to go to plus two. And then my crew bribed me with food to come here instead. The classic mix-up, man. I'm yeah. <laughs> uh, so for those of you that aren't used to going to tournaments and wondering why they're playing rock, paper, scissors, they are deciding as to who will strike stages first or last. Because I actually had a friend. It's, a, it's, it's the fairest game, bro. Everybody right. has no, a yeah. one-frame mix-up. No, no, no. I actually had a friend that came to a tournament for the first time. He was like, why are we playing rock, paper, scissors? It was so hilarious. He was, was so confused. Literally, this is the game where everybody there, there is. Yeah, I know. <laughs> this is the fairest neutral of all time. Everybody has a one frame move. Actually, there, there is a. I'll send you the video. There is a very detailed explanation as to why it's not as balanced as everyone says it is. Because you know, rock paper says you got a one in third chance, right? Yeah. So you know, most balanced you, game. You, it's not. You break a TAC in Marvel Three, you got a one third chance. It's it no, it's a seven three matchup. Hold on a second, hold on a second. Oh, hey! Yeah! Give you some water. I think this is a winner semifinal match. Winner semifinal. I think Fatality still playing his double match, so his side of the bracket is being held up a bit. Maybe. Yo, Fatality, Falcon God. Fatality. Yo, I like the Falcon in this game. He like he slowed down a lot, but I like I just like the general feel of him. Yeah, I think Fatality has said the same thing. Making a quick e gunner, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Apparently, you can't change their. Uh, you can't change their. Uh, you can't change their weight in this game. Yeah. Oh, you know what's weird? There are some players out there, right, that play with multiple control settings, right? So like they make multiple like name tags, or they just change it, whatever the case. What's crazy? Thank you. Appreciate it. What's crazy is. And Squat Strike, right? You're stuck with the name tag you have. So, like, people, like, switch buttons depending on the character that they play. Yeah. You know, Meta Knight, Peach, things like that for float cancels, attack, and whatever the case might be. So, you know, in Squat Strike, I think there's that limited...
there's that restriction that you're stuck with that control scheme, so that changes the characters that you have access to. Which is weird. So we're seeing Ness. Was that me, Gunner? What me is that? Me, Gunner. So we got Ness, me, Gunner, and Lucas. <laughs> so we're a child at heart. I see that. Uh, even with the Ness shirt. This is, oh, yeah. I remember Nova Pixel now. He had the Ness shirt on uh, from last uh, Ultimate Winning Brawl Tournament. And we got, oh, Samus this time? Okay. All right. So I think the Toon Link thing really was just a King K. Rule counterpick. Now we got Samus. For me, Gunner? Question mark. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Because I, I know for a fact Ness and Lucas they have the little absorb thing against that. So we'll see how how that plays out. Unless he just you know main Samus. Three, two, one, All right, go. getting into the match. So I think the names are swap. There we go. And you already know it. Nova Pixel with the Ness, Lucas, and apparently Gunner. Loco playing the Belmont up front. He's got Robo. Well, I said Robo. Robo Cop Law. He's got Robin Samus in that order. Order. Then Lucas and Ness on Nova Pixel side. Oof. Interesting trade. We gonna whip it back and forth. We got some projectiles. Belmont might have a better projectile game than the Meat Gunner. Look at this. Huh. Oh, it definitely eats more shields for sure. Uh oh. Oh, no confirm from the, the Holy Fire? I still don't know the name of that move. Y'all gonna have to help me out that gets hit with a full charge blast. Crazy. Ooh, ooh, misses the down smash. Belmont trying to get some space to start throwing the projectiles. Crossbow's out there, but <laughs> overshoots all the projectiles. Me gunner getting in. Now they're scrambling. Uh, four there. Gets him off the stage, tries to cover with the down B? I can't remember. I didn't know you can hit those. That's interesting. Gentleman combo. Throw him off the stage. Cover with down B. Didn't read the jump, but that's all right. As long as we can keep building damage and keep him off the stage, we're in a position that we want to be in. We went for that one too many times. But that's okay. It looked like a dash attack, and the dash attack killed. Uh-oh. Now he's going to have to fight Rob. Huh. Beyblade? Ooh. Oh, these confirms are so sexy. Down tilt, down tilt, down tilt, down tilt. Are those true? That's crazy. Is that a true block string? Nuts. Oh, nice pivot grab. Ooh. KO. Lucas is up next. And then Ness is last. Nice Zair drop. Ooh. All right. Looking kind of dominant. PK Thunder. Nice tech off of the ledge. I'm not sure if the tech was the right thing to do. It might have spiked him, but he was at a low enough percent, I think, to survive it anyway. It's Rob. He couldn't have died from that, could he? PK fire. Now, Lucas's PK fire is different. It doesn't activate like the... Oh, my goodness. Look at all these... Oh! That was nuts. Oh, and he's out of there. We didn't want none of that. He didn't want the, the, the virtual... What was it? A virtual boy? I can't remember. Whatever that toy was. He didn't want that for Christmas. He said he wants the second game here. Dark Samus or Samus? I can't tell. I think it's Dark Samus. Yeah, it's definitely Dark Samus. Ooh, nice. One of the major differences from Samus and Dark Samus is definitely like the roll and the spot dodge animations. Uh, yeah. And apparently the forward smash is another very subtle change. Uh, most people won't notice that, but I, one of them knocks back farther and faster, the other doesn't. I think regular Samus has the better one. I could be wrong, but I do know it's different for sure. Ooh, nice forward there, but no comp confirm. We get a back throw, PK fire, but misses. I think he was trying to kill with the PK fire, too. Or at least just knock him further away. It's kind of hard to kill Samus if it's not like a kill hit, you know? Because if she survives, she's most likely coming. Oh! All right, that just killed anyway. I thought he was going to, like, double jump up there or up B or something. That would have been nutty. Dark Samus at 126%. And there's 3 minutes and 37, 35 seconds left on the clock. I don't ex... Oh, there's a PK Thunder. He, is he trying to avoid PK Thunder? And it killed him. <laughs> trying to dodge the Thunder, got him killed. Which makes sense, because had he gotten hit by it, he would have reached the threshold, which he couldn't tech anymore. 
That's correct. After 150%, you cannot tech anymore. That's crazy, man. I, you know, I was like, I remember playing Brawl and like C4 myself back up with Snake mm -hmm. and then tech, just teching all the time. Yeah. To like, get, you know, to like stay alive. Yep. No, not this time. After 150, you can't tech? Nope. Yeah, stage spikes are guaranteed. Uh, tech traps are like semi guaranteed. Like, you ha you're forced to play that game, you know, because you can't tech. Oh, okay. Yep. Uh, footstools. You gotta, your DI has to be on point. Yeah, your DI's got to be on point. Uh, footstools become more consistent because you could tech footstools in this game. You couldn't in Smash 4. But in this game, you could tech footstools up until that percentage. Okay. Yep. I guess we're starting a singles bracket on the side, man. 100, yeah. 130 people, man. 130 people. That's crazy. Yeah, man. I mean, it's a new game, new blood. Everybody wants to get a piece of the pie, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And, yeah, they were, we're starting to wind down on squad strikes, so. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect timing. Real good timing. Yep, after 150%, Darvell. Two, one, go! Projectile game. There's going to be a lot of it. Lucas is up first this time instead of Me Gunner. We're saving Me Gunner for second. Oh, uh, very good Nair. PK fire. Oh, went for the PK freeze. Set, not back. Uh-oh, didn't snap to the ledge for some reason, but that's okay. We're good at using the PK Thunder to make it back. Oof. I don't know if that has to be sweet spotted, but I think it does. If it's if that's the case, it's a very good sweet spot. Uh, for there. Projectiles. You know, I see I see Loco doing when he does four airs and stuff. I see he does a lot of straight four airs. He's not really angling them that often. I'd like to see him uh, make uh, more use of using diagonal fares and back airs. But hey, you know, I can't coach him if he's winning, right? Ooh. Oh! We got these whips. Projectile. We can back up. Oh! I forgot Lucas could just bat things back at him. PK fire. Ooh, PK thunder. Oh, that's right. The Belmonts have a terrible recovery. So, like, if they get knocked back too far, you hit them again after a double jump, they're not making it back with that up B. 4-2. Projectiles trying to, trying to, ooh, nice up B kill confirmed. Uh, 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 dash dance. Uh, stop him from charging. Just, just throwing a bluff out there just to get him to start charging, but dash attack right under the bell mine. And what I say, Simon and Richter have a terrible up B. It, it's bad. All right, Beyblades and lasers. And, and Rob himself. Oh, get up attack. Doesn't get punished. <laughs> Did that just combo? Or was he just impatient? Down tilt. Oof. Oh, dash attack in the four there. Beyblade, laser. I think I think what would have been more efficient would have been to throw the Beyblade and then wait for the jump reaction and then throw the laser. But what do I know? I'm commentating. Shooting lasers. Mm, Beyblade into laser. That throw was kind of sick. Tries to get the up air, but no dice. Oh, up smash kill. Now it's up to Ness to bring this on. <laughs> and Rob's just high later. Trying to uh, stall time just for a little bit. Every second counts. Oh, and Beyblade didn't land on the stage. Four there. This is going to cover with the yo-yo. With the back yo-yo at that. So, th oh, I don't know what happened there. But it worked out. So now we got Toon Link. Dark Samus didn't work out too much. Uh, Toon Link definitely has the better tools for spamming, playing the long range game and mobility. He's sm a smaller target, so he can fight uh, to the same capacity and size as Ness and Lucas, unlike like Samus and Dark Samus having to fight uh, Ness and Lucas because, you know, it's a tall body versus short body. They could be hard to hit with a tall character like that. So this will be a lot easier to manage as Toon Link. All right, so it's come down to just that and already uh, Nova Pixel. <laughs> Uh, feeling the effects of having to fight Toon Link. Dash attacks into up tilt, up air. What? PK Thunder racking up as much damage to catch up the best he can. Oh, man. Oh, nice boomerang to forward air confirmed. That's what it looked like. Yep. Ooh, couldn't catch him with the air dodge coming down. 
in this game, there's only one air dodge. So, you know, once they've done the air dodge, that's it. They even patched out the glitch with the, um, the Bowser kids where they get multiple air dodges, even they can't do it anymore. No confirm on the bomb. Oh, that is a death throw, but it didn't kill. I guess DI saves Toon Link this time. Four tilt, I think, is safe ish. Rolls behind him, does another four tilt. Boomerangs, arrows, and bombs. Oh my! Loco putting one on the board with the Toon Link. That's right. What he said, make sure that you guys, when you disconnect from your matches and things like that, just those that are watching or looking back on these fights, remember, turn off, or sorry, disconnect your controller. It's wireless, so make sure that you don't accidentally press that home button and ruin someone's grand finals. And in fact, I don't know if it's Genesis. I think Genesis 6 is enforcing a rule now where after each match, you must take out the battery. And if you don't, uh, you're, that's grounds for, um, you know, moving to losers and then from losers to out of the tournament. Red team versus blue team. Uh. PK fire <laughs> is the opening move by Lucas. Why wouldn't it be, right? That's what a lot of Nesses and Lucas's do. They'll, you know, it's a tool, it's effective. You get away, you throw it. It's low risk is what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, Belmont dash attack is really good. Hits multiple times, it passes through the opponent. So it crosses up, making it harder to punish for those characters who can. Uh, uh, wow, that that low drift falling down there into whatever just happened. <laughs> Ledge jump, PK fire, does it twice. Stacking up damage, PK thunder. Who was about to hit him again for more damage, but then realized he was dead anyway. Let me not save him. Nova Pixel like, nah, we're not going to have this again. That was a Beyblade uh, near the back air. PK fire! Ooh. Nice. Interesting trade. Rob there. Ah, uh, four there. I don't know what to call that move. That move, though, I do know that only does it hit multiple times. It also reflects projectiles. Why? That's crazy. And it, it probably even is uh, it's probably a kill move, too. Maybe. I'm not sure. I think it does. PK Thunder. He doesn't have invincibility, though. Once you grab the ledge one time and exhaust the invincibility frame, the next time you re-snap, you do not have invincibility at all. So you, it's a risk that you're taking. Um, and as the opponent defending the stage, it's worth it to try to throw a hitbox out there just so they can't snap back to the ledge. Ooh. This is going to be frustrating for Rob to deal with. Oh, he's back down on the ground. That's all he needed was just one, one scramble aerial. All right, here we go. Toon Link showed a lot of promise last game, but let's see if he could do it again this game. Nova Pixel looked like he, <laughs> he turned it up a little bit, switched it into third gear, making sure that uh, Loco doesn't get the opportunities that he's trying to create to get the momentum that he wants. Look at him. Look at Nova Pixel's like, like space control. Oh, using the yo-yo, keep him off the ledge. It's so good. Let me turn around and hold down smash real quick. It's crazy. Nova Pixel takes it. Two to one. Listen to that sweet, sweet music. I literally can't run any other match until Fatality is done with um, smash um, the doubles. Oh, well, we're on hold then. Yeah. Yeah, let me, uh, it's a good time to, you know, pause the recording, you know, take a, you know, GB break, you know.